I play very uh, hard, very aggressively, and so strats just, to, for me to keep them in tune, I gotta be like MacGyver, you know what I mean? I gotta have special juices and nectars and tools and elaborate trusses in order to keep them to, to behave for me. Uh, it's not a design flaw, it's the design flaw in me, personally. So the guitar that I can use, that I can treat like a farm animal, and it keeps coming back for more, is the Telecaster. You can treat this thing like a beast, you can use it for chicken picking stuff, you can use it for rock, you can use it for blues, you can use it to funkify, you can do anything on it, and it still just comes back begging for more mistreatment. So uh, I decided, I think I bought this in like 2006, I thought, you know what, I'm just going to... I liked uh, the, the design of the 52 tellies, but I like a flatter radius because I like to be able to bend the strings with a little bit more uh, ease of play and taller frets. And I like 22 frets. You know, the old tellies have 21, but sometimes you're in the key of B and you want to be able to go So I need that 22nd fret. There's be all kinds of people going, if it doesn't have 21, the stuff doesn't line up right, and it doesn't have the same vintage tones. Like, I don't care, I want to play in B. You know what I'm saying? So I like that 22nd fret up there so I can, you know, jiggle it. the idea it's all in your grubby little mitts you can control just by working the volume knob down here it gives you complete control and I demand power let me just say this about gear in general 99% of it is in your hands let's just be clear on that 1% is the gear it's an important 1% and it's a fun yet expensive 1%, but 99% comes in your hand. So if you're bummed out about your tone, spend a little bit more time practicing and less at the music store. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 